Ozark Plateau National Wildlife Refuge is one of Oklahoma's many bat hotspots, and it's also home to the longest known cave system in the state. We caught up with Richard Stark, a biologist with the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service, to learn more about how they're monitoring for these flying mammals. So what we're doing uh, is trying to get a, a better understanding of for which species this particular cave is an important hibernaculum for. And so we are using mist nets and harp traps to capture them as they emerge from the cave at night uh, to begin foraging. And we are uh, banding them and taking certain standard measurements. So the purpose of the bands is, uh, there's a couple of purposes for it. If we, we could compare how many new individuals we've captured and look at how many uh, individuals that we've captured that were banded in the past, and that, that gives us an idea as to how many individuals of each species are utilizing the cave. Another um, important aspect to the banding is that other individuals doing bat work in other areas may end up capturing a bat that was banded here, and that tells us a lot of information about the movement of those bats. We have um, one of the rarest bat species in the area that occurs here called the Ozark Biggard bat. And uh, it's been listed as endangered since 1979, and there are fewer than 2,000 individuals known to occur the entire range of the bat. And we have probably close to 14 or 1,500 out of the um, entire 2,000 individual population here on the refuge. Um, and it, as it turns out, the study that we're doing now also kind of shows to us the importance of this cave for other species as well, um, such as the northern longer bat. What we're doing here right before we go into the winter hibernating season is we're, we're able to catch these individuals that are using the cave. So this, this study in the fall is very important for giving us um, at least a, a better idea as to how many individuals might be utilizing the cave in the winter. The Wildlife Department and Fish and Wildlife Service are longtime partners in conservation. In fact, one of our wildlife management areas, the Ozark Plateau WMA, adjoins the refuge to provide even more foraging habitat for many species of bats, including the federally endangered Ozark Big Eared Bat. Help the Wildlife Department continue these conservation efforts by making a donation to the Wildlife Diversity Program at wildlifedepartment.com.